Good morning. I just got home from boot camp, got ready for the day. It is 7 a.m. and I am hungry for some breakfast. I'm wanting some protein after my workout and some healthy carbohydrates. So here's what we're going to do. I bought the Amy Lou breakfast sausage links at Costco at my last Costco run. These are fantastic. We actually had these when my friend Amy was here this weekend and she loved them. So I'm going to have three of the Amy Lou turkey sausage links. Three links is one serving, 130 calories, 12 grams of protein. And then I'm going to do one over easy egg. And then I'm going to toast up one of the Thomas Light Multigrain English muffins. We're going to top that with some Kerrygold butter and the Chalk Zero Black Cherry Jam. This is so good, it has zero added sugar and is only 15 calories per serving. It's really good if you like cherry and not super, super sweet jam. You'll really like this. I do have a discount for Chalk Zero. I'll link it for you, but that's going to be breakfast. And then I'm going to mix up my greens a little bit later. I have a lot to do today. I have several coaching calls, videos to edit. I also have to put together and mail and email out my meal plan for March. It's going to be a really busy day. So let's start it off with a healthy breakfast. So here is my breakfast. This looks so good. I have one egg, my English muffin with one teaspoon of Kerrygold butter and one tablespoon of Chalk Zero Jam. And then three of those Amy Lou chicken sausages. High protein, great source of carbohydrates. Perfect after a morning workout. I'm going to go ahead and mix up my greens for the day. I do take a green supplement four to five days a week or whenever I just feel like I'm lacking and getting my leafy greens in vegetable wise. This is one of my favorite greens. This is from Motivate. This is in peach. They also make tangerine. You can't go wrong with either of them. They're very, very good. What I love about Motivate greens is it's not grassy. So you don't get that really earthy grassy taste. It's more fruity, which makes it really easy to drink. So here is what it looks like, your typical greens powder. And what I do is I go ahead and add one level scoop to a glass. I usually use about a 16 ounce glass. You still get the really good fruity peach taste and it's not too strong. So this is about the size of glass that I prefer. A lot of people will mix their greens in with just a tiny bit of water. So whatever your preference is. I also love how easy they mix in. You can use a handheld frother, but typically I just stir it in with my straw and they mix beautifully. So here are my greens. And like I said, they taste amazing. Greens are fantastic for both your body and your brain health. I have a hard time getting in all my greens through food. I really, really try, but it doesn't always happen. So utilizing a green supplement a few times a week has been really helpful for me. In addition to that, it helps me get in some water. Greens help support optimal nutrient absorption. They're a great source of alkalizing minerals. They include fiber for digestive support and powerful antioxidants for immune system support. Get your daily greens, super fruits, and veggies in seconds with the Motivate Greens. Motivate Greens can contain organic grasses and vegetables and have a natural source of alkalizing minerals. They include fiber to help with blood sugar levels and bowel health. And like I said, the peach, the tangerine, you can't go wrong with either one. They actually have sample packs of their greens as well in individual little packets. I usually take these when I travel. That way I can still get in my greens even on the road. I do have a 20% off discount code for Motivate. I'll leave it down below for you. Amazing. It's time to play some ball. Yeah! Whoa! Whoa! That's a big jump! Palmer! Palmer, tell them that you ran into the fire pit. He ran into the fire pit the other day and he was bleeding. He got a, his teeth must have punctured his lip a little bit. Poor guy. Troy said it stunned him for two to three seconds, then he was right back to playing ball again. Poor little guy. He's a beast though. Yes, a good job. What are you doing? Huh? <laughs> So I go to the oncologist tomorrow to see how my lymph node is. Hi, baby. Lola, did you want to get Palmer when he come back? Do you want to get Palmer? Yes, yeah, she's a good girl. She's tired today. She's been sleeping a lot. Palmer, let's do one more ball. Drop, Drop for daddy. Good boy. All right, let's go. Yay! 
Just finishing up my greens, then I'm going to start my first cup, my second cup of water for the day, and my collagen for her order just came. I've actually been getting a lot of questions on collagen for her. I wanted to give you guys kind of an update on the brand, on orders, on availability of product. They did go through a transition of owners, and everything is up and running smoothly again. I know a lot of you have reached out asking about your order. Is collagen for her still available on the website? Can you still use my discount code for the 10% off. Yes, yes, and yes. So I actually just got my order. I use the collagen for her collagen in my coffee every single morning. It is back in stock. It's available to order. It is the best collagen in my opinion. It is unflavored. It dissolves beautifully. I don't even have to use a frother. I just add it to my hot shots of coffee in the morning. It is specifically designed for women. So it gives us everything we need in a collagen. I love that it's made specifically for women and collagen is so great for your hair, your skin, your nails, your joints. You know that I swear by collagen. I've been using it every day for years and it really has made a incredible impact on my nails, my hair, joint pain, digestion. It's incredible. If you suffer from thinning hair from weight loss, collagen will definitely help, as well as skin elasticity. I always say that, that I feel like that's part of the reason why I don't have more loose skin is my skin bounced back pretty good because of taking my collagen for her. So I just got two tubs of the unflavored collagen. I also got the little collagen for her packets. I love these when I travel. This is one serving of collagen. I just add it to my coffee water, juice, whatever I'm drinking when I'm traveling. I love that it's just single serve little pack. So I picked up a refill of that. They also have a beauty collagen. They have some amazing supplements. Highly, highly recommend. And I just appreciate that it's made specifically for women. What I also love is you can sign up for monthly shipments. That's what I do is I just have it subscribe and save. It just shows up at my doorstep. Once a month, you actually save a little bit more money. And again, you can use my discount for an additional 10% off or 10% off everything on the collagen for her website. So you you are available to pick this up again. I know a lot of you love it as much as I do. I'll make sure that I link it down below for you. So my 35 grams of protein blended frappuccino. Seriously the best. I love making these at home. So much more affordable than buying them out and I can get in 35 grams of protein, 200 calories. I did just put a video out this last Sunday all about how I make my 35 gram of protein coffee. So I'll link it down below if you missed it, but this is my morning snack and my second cup of coffee. Here is my lunch for today. This is actually my Philly cheesesteak bowl that I made in my meal prep. This is delicious. I have gotten a few questions. Can you put it on a roll? Of course you can. A roll, bread, whatever you want. If you eat it the way that I made it, it's low carb because it's just the meat, the veggies, and the cheese. I think I'm going to just have it as is. We'll see if I'm still hungry. I'll let you know if I have anything else, but this is my lunch for today.
just finished cleaning the house and I'm hungry for an afternoon snack. So I'm going to do three quarters of a cup of Daisy Cottage cheese. So one and a half servings basically of cottage cheese and then 100 grams of fresh blueberries. And then I'm going to do a half of a serving of snickerdoodle almonds. So 14 grams or 14 almonds. I always weigh it out because sometimes you get more than 14 almonds for those 14 grams. These are so good. I have been loving these and this is going to give me a nice healthy fat and some fiber along with lots of protein and a healthy carbohydrate. So here is my snack. So there's my cottage cheese, blueberries and almonds. These little snack plates come in a set of four. I got them off of Amazon. I'll link them for you if you're interested. They are just a plastic plate, but they are great for little snack plates. For dinner tonight, I am making a one pot beef stroganoff. So let me show you what you'll need. First you're going to need beef broth. I am subbing bone broth just for the extra protein. If you do sub bone broth, make sure you add in a little bit more salt. It's not as salty as beef broth. And then pasta of your choice. As always, I'm using my fiber gourmet. Love this. Half the calories, half the points of regular pasta. 24 grams of fiber, 17 net carbs, and seven grams of protein. Love it. Tastes just like regular pasta. I buy mine off of Nutrition. They have all the different shapes. In fact, they just came out with lasagna and they have the best price. So I'll link it down below for you with a discount. Minced garlic, sour cream, Dijon mustard, salt and pepper. I'm going to use red onion since I have it in the fridge, but the recipe actually calls for yellow onion, mushrooms, and then some steak. I picked a really lean cut of steak. So the first thing we're going to do is get out a big stock pot or high sided skillet. I went ahead and chopped up my ground beef. I'm going to let this brown not cook completely through, but get a little bit crispy on all sides. I transferred the steak to a bowl. Any remaining liquid, leave it in your pan and add in your mushrooms and your onion. We're going to let those cook down for about five minutes. I'm going to add in a big scoop of minced garlic and again let that become fragrant. I'm also going to add some salt and pepper. Now I'm going to add in my box of pasta and I'm going to stir it just to get it kind of coated in the liquid. About a tablespoon of Dijon mustard three cups of broth. Go ahead and stir everything together, turn it up to high, and allow it to simmer until the pasta is cooked through. So once you are down to the last few minutes of cooking, we're going to add back in our steak. Stir that in and that will allow that to finish cooking along with the pasta. The fiber gourmet pasta does take a while to cook. I would say that it takes between 15 and 20 minutes. So I've been letting it boil here for quite a while. And by putting it in for the next few minutes, that'll help finish cooking up the steak. Now we are going to stir in two thirds of a cup of sour cream and let that just warm through. It'll be just a couple of minutes. All right, dinner is ready. This smells amazing. It looks amazing. I'm going to go ahead and dish it up and I'll be back to share points, calories, and macros. So here is my dinner. I put about a teaspoon of the grated Parmesan cheese on top and some parsley. Again, all of the information is here on the screen for you. It's the end of the night. I'm going to wash my face and get my jammies on. Lola and I have lots of shows to catch up on since Amy was here. So I'm going to have some dessert. Keeping it simple, I'm going to do my last of the two good remix yogurts. I really like these. I'll definitely be getting some more of these. I just bought a whole case of Oiko's Triple Zero from Costco, so I wanna go through that first. These are amazing. It's really a yogurt bowl in one. You could add fruit to this. You could add Catalina Crunch, really whatever you want, but I'm going to have this one. It is stark chocolate strawberry almond. So it says strawberry base with chia granola, roasted almonds and chocolate blend. It's freaking delicious. And then I'm actually going to have half of a serving of these white chocolate raspberry truffles. So a serving is six pieces for 190 calories. So I'm going to do three pieces for 90 calories along with my yogurt. So let me put the toppings on my yogurt and then I'll give you a close up of the little truffles as well. By the way, these are amazing. Again, Costco. And this says soft truffle ganache, white chocolate coating, crispy quinoa and raspberry pieces. So it has a little bit of crisp to it. I really, really like these. So truffles and yogurt for dessert.
joining me for today's What I Eat in a Day. I hope you enjoyed coming along with me. I will, of course, link Collagen for Her and Motivate at the top of the description box for you. Tonight's dinner recipe is on my website. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe. I do a What I Eat in a Day every Wednesday, and I would love to have you be part of this amazing community. And of course, join my Facebook group, follow me on Instagram, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!